Spinal cord compression. Compression of the spinal cord is often caused by direct pressure from mechanical compression such as disc herniation, spinal stenosis. It could also be from infections such as an epidural abscess or from malignancy where cancer spreads to the spine. It is commonly seen with lung, breast, and prostate cancers. Spinal cord compression in cancer patients is considered an oncologic emergency and requires immediate intervention to prevent permanent neurologic dysfunction. Signs and Symptoms Symptoms of spinal cord compression depend on where the compression is and are seen at the level of spinal compression and below. Severe back pain is usually the first symptom that patients experience, and it gets worse when lying flat and at night. Other neurological symptoms include bilateral weakness on extremities, sensory changes such as paresthesia or numbness and tingling, bowel and bladder dysfunction. It could be either urinary retention or overflow incontinence, constipation or fecal incontinence. It can also lead to paralysis, interventions, frequent neuromuscular assessment per MD order, prepare for MRI of the spine. Surgery consultation for possible laminectomy in which part or all of the vertebral bone is removed to ease pressure on the spinal cords. High dose steroids to reduce swelling around spinal cord. Pain control. Use of neck or back braces if prescribed. Stool softener to prevent constipation, especially if the patient is taking opioids for pain. Intermittent urinary catheterization or placement of a Foley for neurogenic bladder retention. Fall precaution and pressure ulcer prevention due to weakness and immobility.